Mama June Shannon is revealing the dark side of being a reality television icon. She has been in the spotlight for more than a decade as has her family. It has not always been easy, nor has it been fun, and now she is opening up about what it takes to put yourself out there. Keep reading for all of the tea that she spilled. When Mama June and Alana Honey Boo Boo Thompson first appeared on Toddlers and Terras, they made quite the impression. It sparked their own family reality series on TLC. Here comes Honey Boo Boo. That included June's partner, Sugar Bear, and her three other daughters, Anna Cardwell, Jessica Shannon, and Loring Pumpkin Efford Shannon. They were an extremely offbeat and quirky family, which viewers could not turn away from. It lasted four seasons before it was canceled, but was given new life on WeTV, with From Not to Hot. That has been on for several seasons, starting with June's drastic weight loss, Pumpkin's first child, and marriage to Josh Eford. Then, it got dark, following June's addiction, Elena moving in with Pumpkin, Anna Cardwell's passing from cancer, and many moments in between. Though June has been enjoying lavish trips, getting her nails and lashes done, and more, she wants to clarify that it is not all fun and games. There is a downside to being, what she calls herself, a reality television icon, and it made its way to a Reddit thread. She explained that it is not as much money as many people may believe. Additionally, everything in your private life immediately becomes public. Plus, if you are one of the icons of the show, nothing is sacred anymore, and there is constant digging into the skeletons. So, what did followers think of her warning? This is also someone who literally said that she spent one million on drugs. If reality TV is, no a lot of money like everybody thinks it is, then how did she manage that? June obviously doesn't care about the skeletons in her closet, as she had some of the skeletons turn into whole seasons. First off, fans did not feel bad for Mama June, as they did the calculations on what she had spent. It seemed she and the family made quite a pretty penny, so she had no need to complain. At one point, Anna Cardwell sued June and TLC for $300,000 of her HCHBB earnings. Furthermore, followers were struggling trying to decipher what June was trying to explain. She is not known for her punctuation or grammar skills. Due to that, though she was trying to make a point, June sadly dropped the ball. In the end, do you think Mama June painted a valid argument about the downside to reality television? Or is it hard to have empathy for her when she talks about the loss of privacy, but her downfalls are how she has kept the show going? Finally, is she an icon or just a figurehead? Let us know in the comments below.